Nie, ten do chwili wtedy przyszło do kawiczu. Legendary treasure. Hi! Hello, my name is Nazbi. I'm treasure hunter, a artificial extraordinaire. Undaunted by even the coldest snow. This area is frozen solid and packed with monsters. No one in the right mind would set foot here. Ah! Except me, of course. There surely must be treasure resting here in, on this mountain, where everyone else fears to tread. That's what drove me to travel all this way to Mount Lanero. Until I saw you, I really thought I'd be the only one. You must be here for the same reasons that I am, and if you are, you'll be wanting to know what I know about the treasure. Mm. The truth is, by sheer luck, I overheard a legend relating to the treasure on this mountain while I was on my way here. I knew I was a genius for assuming there was treasure on Mount Lanero. Do you want to hear the legend too? Great, then listen up. Hi. For I am Nazbi, a treasure hunter with nothing to hide. The legend goes like this. Skim across snow from spring high in the heavens to the mountain below. Pass through the rings of light to see the light of blessing. Ah! What do you think? There was the real legend of real treasure passed down on this very mountain. Do you know what? Do you know that with a name like Light of Blessing, the treasure's gotta be worth a bundle. I suspect the spring high in the heavens is referring to these springs. The treasure is as good as found. Oh. I'll accept for fighting each part. I don't know what to do with the rings of light beat. I don't see anything like that around here. But I won't give up, because you see, Hi. I'm Nazbi, the Dauntless Treasure Hunter. Not to be confused with my noble steed, Dauntless. <laughs> oh. Okay. What? Oh, fisherman's shoes. No problem. Take a better picture and really. <coughs> Hi! Does that answer your question? Oh, oh. Okay, okay. Escape. <laughs> that is, I got one. Devout swordsman who offered his prayers. I can no longer sense the presence of the mother goddess statue which dwells in the vast canyon. Ah. I gather that you know something of this. So, when I was speaking to the statue, the statues are speaking to me. It's them is speaking, each one is speaking to me. I thought I was always. Highly talking to us, but if they are different ones, uh, which got a statue? The mother got a statue, it's a towering sculpture who served as a model for the rest of us. She dwells in a temple forgotten by all, resting at the end of a deep canyon. I know that one. I went there. It is true, then, the god statue in the canyon has toppled. Uh, these are ill tidings, the vault swordsman. There is the mother god statue. Could I use recall on that? I implore of you to help me restore her. Uh, seek the blue spirit Nadra who chills the air around her as she dances around the heavens. Ah, so Nadra is her. Okay. Uh, when you have gained Nadra's claw, seriously, I got. Three other things, and the one I don't have, I'll offer this spring. Who's neighbor? The spirit who takes the form of a great blue dragon, long in shape. If you search the skies, you may spot neighbor near this very spring. The Valtzers may lend me your aid. What's neighbor's claw? I speak of the sharp claws shrouded in cold on the tips of the blue spirit's limbs. One who approaches too closely puts themselves at great risk. Shoot from afar and a, f and a fragment shoots fall safely to the earth. The Valsaurus may leave your aid. I'll take care of it. Please, I beg this of you.
wintering butterfly. The polar scales of this butterfly's wings cool the air near it. Watching it flutter around snowflakes, it is a thing of beauty. Cooked with monsters, monster parts for a heat resistant elixir. Should I go back to talk to Pura to get some clearance to explore the ruins? It's as hard as a rock, but it's, it's supposedly edible. It restores a small number of hearts and it has cooling effect. Okay, this one's fine. To just get inside. updated okay and hot tennis here mm -hmm. yeah I'm not going there now oh not messing with anything around here mm, should I visit Robbie no uh, should I enter for Hateno I mean, we're free to go anywhere, but I like to follow the path. Except when there is a proper path, then I, I like to check if I can go around it. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of missing the tracker. I'm gonna try to complain to Fura about Zelda. I don't know. I don't usually get stuck like that in the office. Hmm. I think I'll come back and be here a lot more adventures. I <laughs> have to admit. There, as they, there's an action between present and people, with work, hmm. they everything, must search their place in the heart of the main regions. What other village? Hmm. There's actually a new place called Terrytown Yakala, northeast of here. That's a construction, is located there. The same folks who build local lane and Skyview Towers. For some reason, Zona devices are falling near the area more than elsewhere. Hmm. Mm, there's got to be a special reason for it. If you want more info, talk to Atmos down the shot. Uh, Hippo is most of the crew in there. Hmm. Division, main regions, main regions. All the all the time till now, you were talking about Kakariko, not that I went to Kakariko, and I couldn't get anything done. You pointed me to the other two, into Terra Town. So I'm done with Kakariko. I don't think I'm done with Kakariko, but I don't know what I have to do there. You, you were the one that sent Taro there. Let's get that as you can go well, hard work. You knew what's happening there, though you said she's the sunrise. Forest, another chasm in the forest of time, south of our field. Then there are certain statues were discovered at the bottom of it. Statues are different from the one you showed me using the camera. Since we point somewhere new. Uh, okay, she's talking about the ones. Hmm. 
Hmm. Now for the beauty. <laughs> Chasm statues for investigation. Let's change the post depths. It's power now. No, oh. that's, that's too much tax. Uh, my hopes that this should give us healing to such Princess Zelda. Okay, but I think she's talking about the ones that look like Gerudo. You weren't here before. That's the name. Oh. Mm, oh. oh. Oh, hi there. So, the other side of the ruins and some lines. This ruin is very unusual. Uh. They're unique among other ruins that our survey team has discovered, on the surface at least. We need to investigate fully, but most of the team is at the ruin ruins. We're stretched thin these days. And the Mazurian ruins are important after all. Oh. See those ruins over yonder? Those are ring ruins. At least the ones we can see from here, impressive, right? But the ones here are important too, unique among all the ruins. Uh. Still, ever since the entire team found that some slab scrap is an attack in the ring ruins, our leader has been spending all the, his time there. And he took most of the team with him. Ah. Uh. Those are fell over a quick village. The village is to be a quiet place and kind of isolated up in the mountains. Almost a secret in some ways. That's all change. It's far busier now. All sorts of people go there to see what's happened. Ah. So I guess I'm lucky that I get to investigate these ruins. Uh, ruins this important all on my own if I don't want to explore them. You're not really investigating them. You should climb them to investigate them. I didn't pay attention. I don't know if I can afford another one. I can't. Take a picture of this one, or no, this one doesn't matter because it was already translated. Mm -mm. Let's check that. I gotta finish that eventually. No. Oh, it's like that. Okay, let's go back to him. Here, I've got oh. one. If I have this on stone look lane, there I have 12 stones, oh. that's fine. Okay, okay, here's a picture. Ah. Oh, you have one, show me. Hmm. Interesting, I'll get right to translating it. Oh, uh huh, incredible. Oh. It's first hand in Hyrulean history. Here's what the original text says. Mm. The king was late in come this haven, so make it the queen, queen, to sharing tales of her lands, her land, his lands, of shrines all green, glowing, of early days since Haru's founding. Have diverse monsters he realm besiege the realm besiege and assailed unceasing unceasing in strife they brought to despair folks lives life king and queen set 
themselves to bring scourge to end. With might of light and power driven back in vain. And the royal couple made the shrines to see oh, them away. This holy selling, this holy selling being a eclipsed shrines of light. Okay, they were called they. Shrines of Light, but I didn't quite catch what are those words. Great King, Great Queen. What are different words sometimes? He has written Queen in three different ways. Great is written two different ways here. Uh, great King, Great Queen, I think he, he have fought one in where many childhood. That could. That you. I, Ah, is that a lie? I think the you fought you fought um, when I was made in child that I could pass the knowing the knowing that I could pass the knowing huh? oh. I'll walk you through this one the subjects here is the actions King Raro and Queen Sonia undertook not long after Harrow's falling. Mm. With the kingdom established, they were worried for their people, so they set out to eradicate monsters troubling them. They created structures called Shrines of Light to steal the monsters away so that they could never be revived. There's more here about light in time too. The sense I get is that the two of them may have had supernatural powers. Though ah. so it's part of ancient history, it's a feat those of us living today should still be grateful for. Truly an important discovery. Very good, I thank you. Not just with words, but with this as well. Ooh. Ah. Uh, the thought of such incredible historical artifacts falling down all over Harrow is so exciting. According to the stone tablet at uh, local lane, we have 11 tablets left to find. Oh. If you have to find more stone tablets on your travels, get some kind of visual evidence of them and show it to me. I'll make sure there's a nice reward in it for you. <laughs> oh, what a magnificent find. Thank you so much for showing me. Discovery this valuable deserves a special place among my records. I'll hang it up on the mortar wall. Oh. Hmm. Where should it play this one? Maybe on the wall over here. Goodness, but this place could use some tidying up. Uh, so I'll be able to check this story again anytime. Ah. Thank you for bearing with me. I put what you brought me over there. Mm. Uh, you're welcome to come and have a look at the research lab wall anytime. Oh. To find any more stone tablets, please do document them with a picture so I can use, so I can see. Ah, good. So I can check and you put it in order. So the one I got is one of the last ones. Okay, what do I do so you guys let me inside? Do I kill him? I can kill him. supposed to look like an axe. Hmm? You're so... Oh! Oh! Damn, I completely forgot about you. We wanted to hear about them, right? <laughs> After I read. Hey there, going without sleep, sit silence, see the ruins, oh, I was scared. No one's allowed to visit the one ruin that's floating above the village, but... If you read one of these labs in any of the other four, tell me what it says. Oh. I read what it says. Well, you went to see them for me. 
So, what they say? Back in ancient Hyrule, people call sages protect the kingdom. I see, how fascinating. I bet those sages were nearly as strong and wise as Princess Zelda herself. Thank you for telling me about that slab. Truly fascinating stuff. Just three left. I can only imagine what discoveries lie in store. Uh, you had a chance to see more. What was written on them? There were once people blessed by wind, fire, water, and lightning, as well as time and light. Uh, and these people use secret stones to amplify their powers. Wow. They must have had some pretty amazing rocks back when. Mm -hmm. I feel bad about asking you to find all this out for me since you sent scene too. We are so close now, I need to know what each one of the slaps says. You had just some more, what was it then? Uh, so, in this ancient battle, the king and all the sages fought the demon king, but they couldn't defeat him. Still, they try to leave a glimmer of hope behind for the people of the future, for us. That's really something. Mm. Hey, you don't think the upheaval is some kind of sign that the, of the Demon King's resurrection, do you? Huh, you can't be right. You m I must be always thinking things. Thanks for telling me about that slab. Truly fascinating stuff. Just one left. I can only imagine what discovers that in star. And she's more. What was it then? So it's not enough to be exceptional, you need a secret stone to be a sage, or so it seems at least. But what is a secret stone? If it's that special, I'm sure its beauty would put a diamond to shame. So that was the fourth one, I see. Uh, wait a second. If you look at all these lab messages together, don't they sort of read like one single message? You don't think? Could the rest of the message be on this lab in the floating ring ruins? But why? Mm. Oh, this is impossible. Trying to figure this stuff out is making my head hurt. Oh well, at the end of the day, I learned a little something about our history. Thank you for everything. From one side to to another, I'd like to reward you with one of my personal favorite travel necessities. The ring butterflies. Uh, this rare butterfly only shows itself in rays. The organs in its body produce an insulating compound. When made into an elixir, it offers electrical resistance. Ooh. Those are the ring butterflies. I caught these unusual insects on my travels through the far region. They only come out in the rain. You can boil them with monster parts to make an elixir that grants you resistance to electricity. Remember that, you come in handy on your travels, take from me. Alright then, I'll see you around. Ooh. Should I feel deep down how ancient it is? Kido, I got a might too excited for a man my age. I'm going to keep wandering around here, hopefully we'll see each other again on our third travels. Third travels. Okay, but this still doesn't solve my problem. Oh, they're both you know. Keep going now. I really like how possess defeat them those monsters. I have to thank you for bringing a geezer like me to my senses. Talks everything out with Steam and I understand now that he's just a bow short. So he's just a bow short. He charges ahead, makes his own way. We spent our hours discussing the merits of puppies and you know, of carrots, of course. Uh -huh. By the way, during our talks, Sting and I came up with a method of attacking while defending. A lad like you has probably mastered all there is to know about battle, but I'd be glad to share our methods with you if you're interested. I'm interested. Hmm. Normally, you use a shield only for defense, right? Uh, and you can use it to attack. Or can you? You see, if you attach a weapon to a shield, you can then defend and attack at the same time. Uh, Sting and I think it'd be worth trying out with monster horns and rocks. Uh, good thing we got to talking. We believe that if you really run with this idea, it opens up a whole bunch of interesting possibilities. Ah. 
you know, I attached a search on my shield once, but I I don't remember actually using it. It's you. And the battle we were caught up in recently was amazing. You beat those monsters and opened our eyes. I've got to thank you for all that. Okay, and I have been at odds for ages. Now we're turning each other's fields because of you. I wouldn't have guessed I'd ever find any pleasure in his company. One more thing, when Oaken and I were talking, we figured out a method for defending while attacking. And he's just hearing about it, a mistress said, With only a weapon in hand, you can defend yourself normally. But if that shoots your weapon, then you may be able to defend yourself after all. I have never come up with that idea on my own. Groundbreaking stuff. I gotta give most of the credit to walking. Combining your strength with that of others is, is pretty key, in my opinion. Ah, you. Is that a drum? Mm. You heard that? It's coming from around here somewhere. Is that a drum? I don't hear it. What? You can hear it? So that means the sound I'm hearing is the secret sound of the one I'm destined to walk through life with. Could it be so calling just to me? I gotta find who it is. I'll keep searching a little longer. I hear it somewhere right along here. I don't hear anything. Oh. Okay. I think you get a bit lower. But I think this works. Okay, it didn't move. from uh, those from the troop beats hey hey don't interrupt I'm busy calling bees with my beat okay so maybe around ha huh? come on don't look at me like that I know it's goofy but I gotta try see the conductor uh, in the musical troop I play he has been a little down I figure I make him honey creep Crips that should cheer up our master right up. Mm. But I can't get my hands on any cursor bee honey. How am I supposed to make honey crepes without the honey? Uh, that's why I'm trying to lure some bees with my beat. Uh, all I need are three combs of honey. Mm. Someone said there are some beehives around Kakariko village to the north, near the huge hole that opened up. The hole is pretty scary, no way I'm going anywhere near there. <laughs> Honey be mine.
If cleared, there are no guardians. Kakarku village, Katerin village. I take advantage of that. And get to that shrine. This one should be a goal for a boulder over there. Ashes. Mm, I gotta pay attention to those memories. If we can see that in a peak from a train, shoots. What now? This is supposed to be a bit far from the beginning. The game. The shrine purifies the ancient evil. You who have entered here, heed my instruction. You can reflect a projectile if you parry it with your shield at just the right time. Turn the enemy attack against them. Your other attacks are ineffective here. Ready yourself. Could we deflect arrows back to the sender in the previous game? Ah, okay. <laughs> that makes more sense. Damn it. It's hitting the floor before hitting me. Well done. Be mindful of the element of each attack and choose your shield accordingly. Now demonstrate your skill once more. Uh, okay, I think this one isn't a bit of wood, but can I catch more? I think this one's wood. You have proven your mastery, now proceed to the innermost chamber. But I didn't have a uh, Tobus Cross. Oh no, that's a Ruby Rod. Huh? Why is this a rod and this is a sword? What's the difference? Why is this one a rod and this is a sword? Shouldn't both be because rods? And he attacks the same with both. I don't get it why they have different names.
Plays on a shield, she can't carry anymore. Hmm, let me just check if Beetle has milk there. That's new. No, we're not supposed to attach that. Oh, I'll check, I'll check that for us. Beetle. Because I'd see you all the way out here, just make sure it's with wow. me. Oh, Beetles had seen me, Blade Orion Beetle. I have such a weakness for Blade Orion Beetles. Will you give it to me, please? I'll make it worth a while. How about a mighty meeting rice bowl in exchange? It's a deal. I had that already. <laughs> there is good in the world. I'm going to spend the day treating this beetle like royalty. If you think I'm mushy, just wait until you see this beetle's excretions. So, when... Uh, there, you what, what you got? I need milk. Should make the food for the old woman. 